Hey, stop the cap, stop the cap. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Stop Capping. And uh, this is another episode, well, actually, first episode. Um, this is about the rework of the characters currently in Overwatch 2. And, um, you know, these are not the same characters anymore, more or less. Um, especially Bastion. Uh, he's getting reworked now because of his spamming of the his mortar ultimate. Um, is basically... Um, if you're indoors, safe somewhere, especially if you're getting healed, it's almost like uh, spamming a predator, predator drone, like in Mortal War, Modern Warfare 2. Uh, so if you guys are familiar with that game, that's why Blizzard uh, pulled the plug on it. And also, I just found out too, um, they took out uh, Torbjorn and Kariko for ranked matches. Um, they got them locked for ranked matches, and it doesn't matter anymore because I got the golden weapon for Torbjorn and from the last game anyway. So I already earned that B. Um, I earned that bitch. So <laughs> uh, let's get to it. So as you can see for her um, move list, they changed a lot. Uh, they took away the little gravity ball that pulls people in if someone tried to run away. They took away that annoying shield she used to use all the time. She still has Fortified, um, and the Fortified actually looks like it um, adapts to her style, uh, which is pretty good, her new style, and um, you'll see why. Um, so I'll show you right now. Uh, our energy ja javelin launches a javelin at an enemy, stuns them, knocks it back. You can actually knock people off the stage with the energy javelin, which is pretty cool. Uh, we also got javelin spin with R1, where it used to be her, um, what do you call her, gravity ball ability. Oh, yeah, or her, her shield. It's been a while, guys. Uh, spin your javelin, destroy projectiles, block melee hits, and push enemies and increasing forward speed. It also hurts your enemies. Um, it doesn't do a crazy amount of damage, but if you um, go forward to enemy head on and they have a quarter, a quarter, about a quarter health or less than a quarter health left, left uh, you can do, you can, um, you can finish them off uh, with just that damage alone. All right, so, and I'm gonna also show you guys McCree and um, Doomfist's uh, small, um, small uh changes too after this so yeah let's get her there we go so yeah you'll see that so r1 so r1 this is great so you can do this to any type of enemies especially the tanks so with her r1 uh, it blocks moves and everything but also it can knock people off the map Look at that. Not only that, it blocks projectiles, it can injure people, but it can knock people off the map. And if you, know, if you don't believe me in different type of tanks, I mean, even Sigma, good old Sigma. So, you know, you could like come in nowhere, nowhere, pop up, and knock them off. You know, where, where, whether you're crouching or standing still, you could uh, do that. Or you could also uh, chuck the yeah, there you go. You can chug the spear at them. Um, I suggest chugging people with the spear with headshots if they're close enough to a ledge, and um, it just does more damage. If you use, if you hit the body um, more or less, it just hurts them. Um, it doesn't push them back as hard as you do if you do with a headshot. So that's just uh, a tip right there, and I'll, I'll show you the. I'll show you why. It's good to use May Super and her Super. So, so notice how the longer it goes, um, her Terror Surge, the more um, powerful it becomes. And yeah, it gets pretty, it gets pretty powerful. So, if you use something like. Uh, what do we call it? Um, Maze special attacks or the other heroes that I talked about in this video in, in this video to team up for her special, um, her ultimate. Then you can do some crazy damage. So now, if you just do the very basic version of it, where like, hey, she's just charging up and then you know just 
do that. You know, it doesn't do as, it'll still do damage, but it won't do as much damage before. Like, you can even go up to, um, I think, minimum, like, um, below 80 damage. Uh, so fortify. Yeah. There we go. See, that ability helps for her machine gun not to overheat like it did just a while ago. So I'm going to do her uh, surge again. And you can see how it does almost little to no damage with just 66%. And you see it's barely even, it's just a quarter of health. But like I said, if you have someone running away, like, you know, like, you, like a Sombra or tracer and they have like little to no health and you have an ultimate just slap it on them it's it does terror surge pulls them in and you can get a confirmed kill it's like i know it's you rather